beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things came into being through Him. Without Him, not one thing came into being. What has come into being in Him was life, and the life was the light of all people. And the light shines in the darkness, and the darkness did not overcome it. And the Word became flesh and lived among us and we have seen his glory and so we gather together to hear the old old story The angel Gabriel was sent by God to a town in Galilee called Nazareth to a virgin engaged to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. The virgin's name was. Greetings, favored one. The Lord is with you. But she was much perplexed by his words and pondered what sort of greeting this might be. The angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And now you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and you will name him Jesus. And he will be great and will be called the Son of the Most High. And the Lord God will give to him the throne of his ancestor, David. And he will reign over the house of Jacob forever. And of his kingdom there will be. Mary said to the angel, How can this be, since I am a virgin? And the angel said to her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you. The power of the Most High will overshadow you. Therefore, the child to be born will be holy. He will be called Son of God. And now, your relative Elizabeth in her old age has also conceived a son. And this is the sixth month for her who is said to be barren. For nothing will be impossible with God. Then Mary said 
Here am I, the servant of the Lord. Let it be with me according. from her. In those days, a decree went out from Emperor Augustus that all the world should be registered. This was the first registration and was taken while Quirinius was governor of Syria all went to their own towns to be registered. Joseph also went from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, to Judea, to the city of David called Bethlehem, because he was descended from the house and family of David. He went to be registered with Mary, to whom he was engaged and who was expecting a child. While they were there, the time came for her to deliver her child. And she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in bands of cloth. And laid him in a manger because there was no place for them in the end. In that region, there were shepherds living in the fields, keeping watch over their flocks by night. Then the angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for see, I am bringing you good news of great joy. For all the people to you this day is born in the city of David a Savior who is the Messiah the Lord this will be a sign for you you will find the child wrapped in bands of cloth and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven and on earth peace among those whom he favors. When the, shepherd, when the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go now to Bethlehem and see this thing that has taken place, which the Lord has made known to us. And so they went with him. Mary and Joseph and the child lying in a manger. When they saw this, they made known what had been told them about this child. All who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds told them.
but Mary treasured all these words and pondered them in her heart. And the shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen as it had been told them. Came flesh and lived among us, and we have seen his glory, the glory as of a father's only son, full of grace and truth. The law indeed was given through Moses, grace and truth came through Jesus Christ, no one has ever seen God, it is God the only Son, who is close to Amen.